people have believed in werewolves for a thousand years. You know, it's such an intriguing animal. And so when I got the script, the you know first draft, I was just like drawn into this world. Like, wow, there's this whole mystery, and everything has been enhanced from the original tale. I mean, I think that's what's kind of great about fairy tales, why they have endured. Like, each generation will kind of update them. They'll put their own spin. You know, sometimes they make the, they've made the fairy tales more like of a moral, you know, preachy, instead of more visceral, where the wolf could really be bad, or, you know, there could be sexual uh, undertones, you know. And that's why they are interesting, that you can keep refashioning them, you know, with your feelings. So we like the fact that Amanda character is strong. She's not really scared of the wolf. She doesn't back down. She's scared, but she maintains her strength. Well, I had known Amanda. She'd been at my house before with like a meal and, you know, other people. So I kind of had my eyes on her. I'd seen her speak at like a, you know, um, a benefit and she was very touching and I really felt like she had a lot of heart, you know, and she had the biggest eyes and she looks like she's straight out of a fairy tale. But then you watch her in all her other movies. I mean, she can be sexy and Chloe. She can be funny in Mean Girls and, you know, just charming in Mamma Mia. So this girl kind of has no limits. She can really do anything. Well, that was a big challenge because you're on a soundstage. You have to create snow and create an atmosphere. And then we did have like five or six days where we went out on location. So how do you make the two worlds blend together with lighting, with atmosphere with colors and feel like you're in one world you know that is a big deal on a on a limited budget you've got to really stretch it and take your imagination and those of the crew and you know everybody and then there was a big challenge with a wolf that did not exist we could not for the life of us we could not get a real wolf to come and do what that wolf needed to do <laughs> now we did have a real wolf one day and it was not cooperative <laughs> so you know that was something that you're really creating character from nothing, you know, and that was fascinating. I've never done that before. Well, I worked with a lot of great directors. Two of the directors I worked with had best, you know, best picture nominations this year. David O. Russell, Lisa Cholodinko. I worked with Cameron Crowe, Richard Linklater. You know, wonderful directors that, you know, I see their energy on set and what they bring and how much they were prepared for the project, how deeply they'd thought about everything. And, you know, that's, that's inspiring. <laughs>